Hello all, uh, welcome to the new video. In this video, you will find what is the noise figure of an ideal amplifier. So before going further, we need to define two things. Uh, first one is uh, noise figure. Uh, but before that, we should also know what is noise factor. Okay. So noise factor is the first uh, definition which you need to know. And then you can understand what is noise figure. Only after knowing noise factor, you need to know what is noise figure. Both uh, these terms are invariably used in place of each other. So we need to understand the minor difference. Uh, coming to the noise factor, it is the ratio of actual noise to that which would remain if the device itself did not introduce any noise. So this is the simple definition, but it is complicated if you do not understand it well. Say, there is something called device in the, the definition of noise factor. So let's draw the device. Say this is a device and that it is amplifier. So as you know, uh, amplifier will take input and it will amplify the signal. So coming to, uh, let's apply this noise factor definition to the amplifier. So what is the noise factor of amplifier? It is the ratio of actual noise to that which would remain if amplifier itself did not introduce any noise. As you can see, I have just, uh, in place of device, I have renamed it as amplifier and just defined it. So the noise factor of an amplifier is the ratio of actual noise. Let's say actual noise at the output of the amplifier is MO. To that which would remain if the device itself did not introduce any noise. Now that uh, the amplifier has introduced some noise. So the actual output noise we have said it as MO. However, say our input signal is something like this. There is a signal and there is some noise, inherent noise associated with it. So uh, every signal will have a, another term called signal to noise ratio. So, so signal to noise ratio is nothing but the ratio of uh, signal power to that of noise power. Let's say the noise power which we had given to the input was Ni. So it would remain same as Ni if the amplifier did not introduce any noise. Say it would come as Ni. But since it has, uh, our amplifier has introduced some noise, actual output noise is MO. Uh, but noise factor uh, states that you need to have the, the, uh, the noise which was given as an input to the device. That is Ni. So, NO upon Ni. So, let's see again what is this definition. It is the ratio of actual noise. Now, the actual noise at the output of the amplifier is MO. To that which would remain if the device itself did not introduce any noise. Okay, so if amplifier did not introduce any noise, then uh, the no noise actual noise output would be Ni. So that is Ni. So that is how uh, we define noise factor. So and uh, noise factor can also be defined as noise factor can also be defined as SNR of I ratio of SNR of I to that of SNR of O ok now say this is a, our device amplifier this is input and this is output so since input signal has a characteristic say SNR of I output will be having SNR of O so noise factor is equal to ratio of SNR of input upon SNR of output. So noise factor is the measure of how much a device such as say amplifier degrades the signal to noise ratio. Uh, always remember that it is always greater than or equal to 1. And uh, coming to the noise figure, noise figure is nothing but noise figure is nothing but uh, the noise factor in dB. Noise factor in decibels. So that is the simple difference. So if we are talking about noise figure, we need to understand what is noise factor. 
So now we have understood what is noise factor. It is the ratio of SNR of 5 to that of SNR of 4. So now coming to our uh, main aim of this video, we need to find what is the noise figure of an ideal amplifier. So noise factor in dB is nothing but uh, to calculate this in dB, we need to have 10 log of SNR of 5 upon SNR of 4. So that is 10 log SNR of 5 log A minus log B log SNR of 4. So this is how we define noise. Uh, so we got to know that noise figure is nothing but noise factor um, which is represented in decibels. So as you can see noise figure is nothing but SNR of I in decibels minus SNR of O in decibels. So coming to the ideal amplifier, what is the noise figure of an ideal amplifier? Noise figure of an ideal amplifier. Say this is the ideal amplifier and this is input and this is output. So uh, for ideal amplifier the device will not introduce any noise. So noise factor is uh, defined as noise factor is defined as SNR of I upon SNR of O. So uh, if the device had introduced any noise it would have degraded the SNR of input. Okay. Uh, so the signal to noise ratio it would be greater than noise factor would be greater than 1 if device had introduced noise if device had introduced noise however ideal amplifier this ideal amplifier will not introduce any noise will not introduce any new noise introduce any noise. So for noise figure of an ideal amplifier, noise factor of an ideal amplifier is 1. Okay. So the noise figure is nothing but noise factor introduced in dB. I mean represented in dB. So let's see we'll uh, do 10 log both sides. Ten into log ten to the base one. So this is nothing but zero dB. So this is the noise figure of an ideal amplifier is zero decibels because the device will not inter ideal amplifier will not introduce any noise. So that's how you calculate noise figure of an ideal amplifier. So in the coming videos we'll clarify a few more doubts. Uh, for now, if you have any doubts, please use the comment section. Thank you. And uh, please uh, don't forget to subscribe our channel. Also, please like our Facebook page. Thank you.